Good evening and welcome to 30 minutes of relaxation and rejuvenation. These are precious moments that we have when we make the choice to spend time finding our inner peace, our inner light, and learning how to really appreciate who we are, what we are on the inside. So often it can happen that during our days, if we're working, we're involved with a project, whatever it is, that we can feel that we're losing, kind of like losing ourselves, losing our power. And it's a wonderful thing to learn how to take power within from the divine, knowing that our true being is divine and that we can access real spiritual power in these moments. And part of that formula can be, I choose to let go of my day. I choose to be present in this moment. I choose to slow my mind down and it helps to just start breathing, first finding a comfortable place to sit and then to take some belly breaths, just feeling connected to that deep place in your tummy and then slowly breathing in deeply hold for a moment and then blow out and again breathing in through your nostrils Deep breathing, hold, and then release. And as we do our last breath in and out, we can be focusing on a beautiful thought that I'm a pure, peaceful being. I am a pure and peaceful being. And you can even add to that if you like, a pure, peaceful being of life. So inhale I am your peace 
full being of life and feeling and it's as if those words and that breath help in clearing out any of the cobwebs or, you know, sometimes we're, we're a little bit confused or we've been, um, something is holding sometimes within us. But when we breathe with a powerful, positive affirmation about the self, then we're clearing out that negative or compromising energy. So let's take one more. Breath in. I am a pure, peaceful, and powerful being of light. Sailing. and feeling more relaxed, clearer, and in a place where we need to check uh, at least once a day, many times a day, sometimes, that I, the inner being, I lovingly accept myself exactly as I am in this moment. So having let go of thoughts about the day, you that we're letting go of everything outside, actually. And we've slowed ourselves down. And I affirm to myself, I'm a very kind and generous hearted being. Sometimes I forget, but I can remember that now, that this is the true, original, and eternal consciousness of my being. I'm a loving being, a peaceful being, a joyful being. I have no selfish desires. And this is something we can all check and strive for. It doesn't happen all the time, but I can think about it because sometimes we have to be very aware that it's important to take care of ourselves first. But when we truly take care of ourselves, it's not a selfish act. It's really a kind and caring act for the self. You 
Now imagine as we move into these beautiful waves of peace, that you can see yourself in a beautiful meadow with the ocean very close by And imagine that this place outdoors, this beautiful place, is the world where everyone is kind and caring, just like you. And as you walk through this beautiful meadow that overlooks the water, imagine that everyone in this world <clears throat> not only is kind and caring, but they know deep inside themselves that they are love. That sparkles at light, that eternal light of pure love. And they also know just automatically that they're loved by those around them. And they have confidence natural confidence because of this natural love, this natural peace, this natural experience of well-being all the time. Now breathing in, filling up with that love, that light, that peace that you are, and just breathing out and relaxing again. And let that light of love surround you. In this beautiful world. Where each one knows that they're loved. And loved. Each one of us comes into this world, each one, with love and beauty. And sometimes people forget and sometimes we have even forgotten. So we need to remind ourselves of our love and beauty and that when others are not exhibiting any love or kindness, 
they've just forgotten and they may be too busy or they may feel stress or feel that they have too many burdens. We can all feel like that at times. And really, it's just a mindset. Because when I shift my awareness and I talk to myself, everything's okay. I can manage. I can take that thing that is the most important right now and I can deal with it and then we'll look at the next situation that needs to be solved and when it's time for us to take these precious moments of truly realizing little bits and pieces of our real, true, eternal being. I need to do that because that's what brings light into the world my own self-awareness of my own true identity. My eternal consciousness, my soul identity. I may not like what others do sometimes, but I can let that go and go into the truth and remember that I have love at my core. I go into the truth that I, the inner being, have a well of love at my core. And though others may be grumpy and not friendly, I can Remember that they too have love at their core. And when I stay in that space of self-realization that I, the inner being, the light, the star, it lives within this body. It takes away any negative emotions and brings into my awareness, my positive qualities. Each one of us have a very special gift. To bring into this world. And that special gift is your own quality and qualities that you 
that make you thrive, that, that allow you to soar, to fly beyond the mundane world In just a moment, you can fly that light of peace, that light of love that lives inside of you in a very incognito way. That presence can fly with one thought. The thought that I am a divine being. And I belong to the supreme divine being. And that I know that everyone in this world has love at their core as well. And that they too are these lights. Maybe they're not conscious of it, but the more conscious I become of my divine light and that I can focus that light and move that light, a metaphysical light, not physical, that energetic presence, fly into the sky, beyond the mundane, into a golden red light of absolute contentedness, absolute peace and love. It's like a world of sparkling lights of my soul brothers and just experiencing that the brightest light of all in this world of light, the supreme being, supreme star, the one who loves each and every one of us unconditionally. all the time. The one who is constant and never changes, always full of this love, this peace, this joy. And so just in this moment, think of something, a quality, a virtue, or something you'd like to fill your heart with. Something you feel you may be missing right now in this moment.
because we forget sometimes that we are pure, peaceful, powerful, loveful, deeply happy beings of light. So see that special quality that you have decided that, yes, this belongs to me. It's mine and I forgot that I can just think of it with good intentions. And it belongs to me. It could be something like courage, resilience. forgiveness, self-love, lightness, releasing myself from any heaviness or burden. Knowing that I can express myself in my own unique way. Each one of us unique. Each one of us light, but in our own special way. And so, hold on to your specialties, your qualities. Knowing that you are very important as part of the tapestry of this world. And that with one glance towards someone else with a positive attitude, you're doing service with your vibrations and your good intentions. Sometimes the smallest things, the smallest moments can make the biggest difference. So thank you so much for sharing and being here tonight and may you have a very peaceful evening and remember that you are very important to the world just the way you are. Oh. Thank mm -hmm.